Hi, good morning. Well, it's not morning anymore. <laughs> you know what? It's almost noon. Yes, in five minutes. And it's the first time that BG fell asleep. So, whew, I've been so stressed out. I haven't been crafting in days now. I don't know how many days, but uh, now he fell asleep and I was like, oh, I still want to craft, but I can't get an idea that quick, you know, because there are so many ideas in my head. So, I remembered that I have my my screenshots. We we will still continue with the screenshots. So I will show you the screenshot. I just picked something very easy because I don't know how long he's gonna sleep. And I really need to create something today, otherwise I'm going to explode. So this is the screenshot. Easy peasy, right? That's something that, you know, we, we know already something that we do know already but it i don't know about you but all those little things escaped my mind and i still didn't look up what eva did she did something with these and once she did it i started collecting them i stopped already so <laughs> i'm done collecting them because i have a few and i have never done anything with them so you know today i'm going to make this envelope and i do have one that looks exactly like on the envelope and that's all I'm gonna do because I'm I'm just I've been so stressed out and for the second day in a row my neck hurts so bad that I cannot move it but uh, I'm uh, onion dyeing paper you see my my fingertips are stained because the water is so yellowish brown reddish and I'm constantly in there dipping the paper so yeah there is that oh oh <laughs> I really <laughs> really have pain in my neck yeah pain in my neck so we got our solar thank goodness so that was two days last week and um that was super exhausting on me i haven't you know i didn't have to do anything i'm trying to fold this while we talk is that okay i didn't have to do anything but let me start here I don't know. I don't even know what to do. Uh, they would constantly go in and out and work. And Luna, she's so protective. She wants to bark all the time at everybody who is outside, right? So it was it was very, very stressful. I felt by the end of it, I felt like I have been working 12 days on the roof. <laughs> Not them. Oh my God, they work in this heat. You know, I... I gave him as much cold water and Gatorade and whatever as I could, as they wanted. So at least something, but there was nothing else I could do for them in the heat, right? So, oh God. Yeah, that was something. Then my hubby got his car. Thank God. So I have a car now, but I couldn't go anywhere yet because I'm so sick now. <laughs> I couldn't even go anywhere yet. Well, I had my car for what? Four days now four days <laughs> so i'm good i will i went the very first day i did grocery but then i didn't go anywhere because yeah my neck and everything just just everything so i think this is gonna be like like this and then this is gonna be like this. i don't even know how to make an envelope yeah that's what i'm gonna do uh what else my sewing machine broke i repaired it i'm a repairman I should go work for, you know, repair sewing machines. I have no idea about sewing machines, but I have repaired mine a few times now. Do I leave it here or do I just cut a teeny tiny bit off? Because kind of it all oh, annoys me. You know, I either need two edges that are not straight or two edges that are straight. <laughs> I, I can't work like this. But let's just, just the tiniest bit here. I'm going to cut off. Oh, yeah, I repaired my sewing machine. Took me two days. Took it apart. Exchanged, you know, I have an extra bobbin. I have an extra this, extra that. I, I took another thread. I took everything I could. I changed. It didn't work. This didn't work. Clean. Didn't work. Took it all apart. The whole freaking thing. Cleaned it out. Did everything I could. Oiled it. Did absolutely everything. And then assembled and it worked. So that's basically my skills. <laughs> I'm a skilled person now who can do that. Now I'm thinking I'm going to put just a little bit. So wait, a little bit or more. 
just a little bit so when we put stuff in and out it doesn't come come out that easily yeah it doesn't rip that easily there you go it should come out easy just not rip yeah now i can sew again i'm behind now because of all of the days that i couldn't do anything i'm behind on things that i need to get done and that just stresses me out the whole there was a lot of stuff that you probably don't even want to hear you know the whole insurance and this and that and nobody can explain to me something so we had for just a just a short period of time really two weeks or something we had three cars right and we paid for the three cards uh, cars they quoted us we were supposed to pay three hundred dollars a month insurance so we're paying three hundred dollars a month then my husband car broke down and um, we got rid of it so now only two cars are insured but we are paying three hundred dollars a week um a month insurance the same amount and nobody is explaining to us why they cannot explain to me why because you know my car is about seventy dollars less than that a month and michelle's car is about 150 dollars it's what 220 dollars but we pay three or five and i'm i keep calling the insurance and nobody can explain to me how this works why this is like it is but they still charge us every month the 300 dollars, and i'm just you know it's triple a it's not some shady weird insurance nobody heard of it's triple a so i would assume an insurance that you know is that popular and known would know what they are doing and it might be right i'm not saying they are wrong but i'm saying please explain to me why you know nobody none can explain it to me i was on phone for hours the day before yesterday this lady tried to figure it out she didn't know when i told her my concerns and explained to her you know in numbers because i'm a number person for me numbers don't lie they have to make sense you know so if you have this number and this number there is no way that you get a different number because those numbers are there so if one plus one will be two there is no way it's going to be three or four because that's not how it works with numbers but apparently 70 plus 150 equals three or five. Oh my god i'm sorry i'm, I'm yelling <laughs> you hear that <laughs> i'm getting older uh, it's just so frustrating to me <laughs> I'm getting all one up again. It's no good for me. It's no good. And this is how I've been. So the day before yesterday, and I spoke to her for over an hour. And then she wanted to speak to her um, supervisor to figure that out. This is going to be closed up, right? Yeah, I guess so. Um, but I'm still going to do it just in case. Um, she said she will call me back so she called me back two hours later it was like 9 p.m already she called me back my usual sleepy time mine and bj's is 7 p.m we go upstairs because bj needs to go to bed so he had to wait till nine he was not amused he was so grumpy i was grumpy already but she still didn't know she sent me she spoke to her supervisor and she sent me the accurate numbers for each car for a year so while I was talking to her I divided the numbers and then I added them up and we did not get close to three or five so there was the same problem still there now she said she's gonna call me back tomorrow tomorrow was yesterday nobody called me back so the night after this insurance debacle i slept funny so yesterday i woke up i could not move my head at all it was just stiff facing front and pain and if i moved it or did something my head was exploding i i get um bad headaches sometimes like really bad i have to put my mask on my face and everything but this didn't come close to what i felt yesterday yesterday i thought it's gonna truly explode so i stressed out too much and then this morning i woke up and my head is hurting uh, my head my neck is hurting still not that bad 
but after all of that I decided I have to do something I have to craft otherwise I need this Vuza. <laughs> Did you hear me? I'm so sorry if I was yelling. I realized that I probably was. I was yelling, wasn't I? I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, okay. It's just, it's just annoying. It's just annoying. People, I don't know, they should know what they are doing and why they are doing this. I don't know. Okay, I, I can't find the beginning which doesn't even matter does it i'm gonna use this just to prove my husband wrong <laughs> because he was laughing at me when i rescued this from the garage so how do we do that let me cut one oh i left i left my scissors in the okay doesn't matter i have these scissors so it's gonna basically be attached i think to this thing and then it will go around this and then it will be hanging down and then I need to make some knots. So I'm thinking maybe that long, but I don't know, is it attached to both? Will, uh, will it be just hanging there or is this attached to the, I don't know, the picture doesn't say it. Will this be attached to the envelope? If yes, then I have to do something else to the envelope to make it sturdier. Because what I can see in the picture is that this is wrapped around this part this i can tell already that this is wrapped around and i'm assuming maybe knotted in the back so i'm gonna wrap it a couple times because wow what am I, i'm wrapping it and i'm un, unwrapping it right away and i'm just thinking why, why doesn't this work because i don't know how to wrap things around Okay, not here. One more time and then I'm done. So, yeah. And then this morning I woke up. Neck still hurting, but not as bad. So I have to at least vacuum the living room, which I did. And I was waiting for BG to fall asleep. I did not upload videos. I, I did not do anything from my list for, I think... I don't know, did I do it Sunday? Yeah, I think Sunday I did. So yesterday, yesterday, yeah. Yesterday I didn't do anything, like absolutely nothing. I'm wondering now, how is this going to be attached? So if I attach it here and then wrap it around, where does it go? It just wraps around this piece. I think so. I think that would be it, right? So I just, all I have to do, I have to attach this one, right? Because then I have to wrap it and then I have to wrap it right here around this. So this is, this is how it's going to close. But now I do have this big knot in the back, which I don't want in the back anymore. I'm just going to leave it here. And what do I do with this? Cut it short, put some glue in it. Okay, I definitely need to put something on this to make it sturdier so I can... And how do I attach this? I just glue it. I would like to sew it on top, but I don't think that's going to work now. <laughs> this little simple thing, I have no idea how to do. Just because. Okay, let me see. I have, let me get some kind of stock left over here. Mm. If I could move freely, that would be so much better. But no. Okay, let me see. Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. What do I have? I need some kind of stock. I need some. I do have this. Somebody did for me. It might look what do you think might you know but just because it has flowers I don't know if you can see but and then what would I just attach it would I just I don't know what I do need to do is to cut it to size and how do I do that and I guess I will just cut it wherever Oh my good lord. 
I can't even do this straight. Uh, somewhat. <laughs> it's not really straight. <laughs> and I don't know if this is going to work. Oh, die cuts with the view. There is a piece of paper which made it yellow, which is not very nice, but it did. So I'm just going to cut it. This way I'm going to use something from the things that I have, which makes me happy to use up things that was given to me. So makes me even more happy. Something that was given to me can be used. Okay, let's see if that's big enough. It's too big. I have to cut it short there. I should have, yeah, I should have right away because I want it to be on the inside. So let's cut it from each side a little. Maybe, maybe it's not even enough. Maybe I need to cut off more. I do not know. I will see soon. I think that that fits. That fits perfectly. But then I'm also thinking, should I put something on here? Will it be opened up or will something be just stuck in there? That's a good question, isn't it? I'm going to distress this. And I'm going to, oh, not you, but you. Oh no, I'm getting the headache back. Go away, headache. Go. It's probably because my head is not straight now, but looking down, there must be some pinched nerve. Now, next on our list is to go ahead and get me a new bed and a new mattress because I need something. I can't sleep anymore. I cannot sleep anymore. And not having sleep is the worst. My sleep is so bad already all the time. Oh, you know what? I messed up a little bit. I need to cut this one too, because otherwise it's gonna be right there in the fold and I don't want this to be in the fold. Okay, much better. Okay, just press it one more time. Yeah, so I've been, you know, my birthday present because they know that I don't want anything else. My, my husband, for my birthday present, he said, it's a bed and a phone. Wow. Do you see this? How crooked this is? Okay, if I put it a little down. Oh my good Lord. That's extremely crooked, guys. I'm sorry. I don't know if I made it better or worse now, but <laughs> we'll see. So for Christmas or for my birthday, it's both so close. I don't know which one it was. Um, it was, get me a new bed, get me a new phone. And you think I got any of it? No. Not because they don't want to give it to me, but because I am who I am. <laughs> I'm like, but my phone still works, you know. If you don't give me a present present, but just like, you know, oh, we're going to go and then you can pick out this. I'm not getting it <laughs> because that's me. Then I start to, it's like a chore to me. I have to go to a store and I have to pick something out and I have to see the price for this thing, which I don't want to pay. I have my own relationship with money here, which is not a very good one. Um, okay, what do you think? I think that this knot is going to annoy me. But I can just put it up there. Oh, that's true. I can just put it up there into this. You know, not not directly in the back, but more like on top. If that makes any sense. Well, that, that's fine, I guess. I don't know. Just trying to make it really sturdy so it doesn't open up on me. Okay. And now I just need to figure out how to, 
How do you do that, guys? I don't want this. I'm kind of thinking that I don't like it. Maybe this thick one is not the right one. I'm going to undo it because it's too much bulk here on top. Maybe I'm not proving my husband wrong today with this one. I will, we'll just use the other one. <laughs> Dang it. You know, something happened to me. I'm, I do not curse. Well, I do not curse in English. I don't say bad words. <laughs> I don't say, I used to say bad words in Russian when I was younger with my friends, right? But for the longest time, I don't curse and I don't say anything bad. But for the past two or three weeks, I've been saying, S-H-I-T. I don't even know. Are you allowed to say this on YouTube? So I've been saying this word so much. I've never, I don't say it usually. Never. <laughs> Not even like a little bit. And now it's like S this and S that. And even when I'm by myself. Mostly when I'm by myself. And I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know why it started and I don't know how to stop it. I don't know. What have I become? <laughs> and then I told my husband this just two days ago. I said, I don't know what happened, but I'm using this word. And he said, I noticed. <gasps> and it was like, oh no, <laughs> it's noticeable. <laughs> What's happening here? I don't know. You know, I don't mind if people curse, you know, it's their own decision. It's just not what I do. I don't know. It's just not in my vocabulary. It's not how I learned this language. I don't know, but I don't know what happened. I really do not. So this is how it's come. Yeah, this much better. It's not bulky at all. See, this is how it will go once. Once I put it on there, I just don't know how to put it on there. Should I just glue it on there? I... Okay. Doesn't matter. I want this to be more sturdy too. So now I'm thinking, am I doing this through decorating this outer part? Probably, right? This one is good. I like the flap. Flap is good now. So let's decorate this outer part. He's still sleeping, which is very good. And maybe I, I'm not going to collage or anything. I do have some really pretty pieces of paper here that I salvaged from Happy Mail. So, you know, maybe that's just what I should do. Use it up. Because I did salvage it. And I think I'm just going to cut here. This is just the ripped part. There is not really any design on it, just to say whatever was ripped out. Yeah, so I salvaged as much as I could from the Happy Meals that I got, or Michelle got, and I got, and you know, and I think that's a good thing. Okay, so I'm gonna cut right here. And this way I can put it somewhere else and it's still going to be super pretty, but wow, if I could have done it straight, it would have been so much better, wouldn't it? I think so. It's so crooked. Yeah, however, somehow I ended up, I ended up being... So mad in this video. I don't want to be mad. I want to get up here and feel good and relax. And not all stressed out because I was telling you about my stress. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, maybe like this. And then here, because it was ripped, 
I'm thinking, don't I have like, oh, didn't I have somewhere here? No, I don't think this one would work. Or would it work? It would work. See, I, I was thinking something like this. But then, what do I put there? I love it when I can just grab stuff from my desk and finally use it for something. But sometimes it's just not working for what I want to use it for. Maybe put this here. And then maybe we have some other tag or something. Oh, if I could move better, it would be so much better. No, I think they are too small. Are they too small? No, not really. Okay, I just need some different piece of paper for underneath. And I'm going to kind of stress this. To stress this a little more. Stress this out. <laughs> yeah, I'm stressing you out. <laughs> and I have this piece here from my it's a coffee filter. I love my little coffee filters. Love, love, love. Like that. And like that. And then I have a little bit of my ribbon showing through here. I think that's a good thing. But now I just want to cut off the edges here. Okay, 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 okay. See what you're doing. See what you're doing. Just need to put it the right way around. What's the right way? I don't know. I'm not gonna glue like the whole filter. I don't care if edges are standing up or whatever. That's fine with me. A little more I will glue. Oh, no, no, no. It fell right on my jeans and I'm wearing, well, shorts, but still, I'm wearing the good pants right now. <laughs> Just because my USPS lady is coming in a bit. <laughs> so I'm wearing the good pants. <laughs> Not the stuff I would usually wear here. Okay, I'm gonna glue this down too while we're working. Oh, there are still leftovers, you see, because I ripped it from something. So let's try and get these off, and that's fine. That makes me so happy now. I wasn't sure when I was um, taking apart the Happy Mail. It kind of hurt me. And, you know, but now that I use a part of it, it makes me feel better again right away. So I don't know. Oh, I think I glued it too far on this. Yeah, I did. You see, now we have this part here that we have to somehow, somehow we need to find something very pretty for this part. Do I have, no problem, not. oh, yeah, I do have another piece here. Oh, I think that would be good. I'm thinking right now, do I cut it straight or do I try to cut it straight myself? There is a line here, so I could just cut it wherever the line is and hope for the best. Look. See? Would that be pretty? You think so? What do you think? This edge is just two edges are distressed already, so that's good. And I would just go here and do it all the way up here. And then I will distress this part. Oh yeah. Is it gonna be covered up in any way? Because <laughs> this is not straight and it's not going to be covered up. So I have to cut it one more time. Okay, so I'm just gonna glue it down there. Guess who's awake? <sighs> Guess who is awake? Guess who? It's okay. He still didn't start. <laughs> so, okay. And I'm just going to put this down here. I'm going to put some glue underneath this ribbon that I stuck in there. Just so it's in place and then on top too just so it definitely stays in place right 
because we need it to stay in place and put it right here oh my god I can move I can move I put like a heat pillow I don't know I brought one with me from Germany and then I put it on my neck yesterday all day and I need to do it again now and I also need a coffee break I can have a little coffee again did I tell you that my stomach doesn't kill me that much anymore. I'm getting better very slowly, I must say. I've never, I always had problems with my stomach, but I have never had something like this. So, but don't matter, very slowly, I take it. I take the very slowly as long as it's, you know, working at all. And here, I don't know, do I put anything on here? I don't think so maybe on here Ooh. oh on the screenshot there was some some ribbon i believe some ribbon and fabric Ooh, don't i have like fabric snip Ooh, uh, sorry <laughs> fabric snippets made already oh look oh, that's so pretty but will it be still pretty with the metal thing here no it's not gonna be good because this is when I want to wrap it around, this one, it would not work for sure. would not work. Do we have anything like that would be easier to use? Let's see if I stick this on here and I want to wrap this around. Oh, this, this would work. There is not too much. Okay. You know what I should do? I should sew it on here and I should have sewn it with this thing. What do you think? That's what I think. Okay. Am I going to undo it again? Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Why are we always working backwards here? I want to cut this off. Hello. There you go. Okay, now I don't know if it's still going to be enough. <laughs> we will see. Okay, let me get the needle from here. Get the needle. Push it. Ah, ah, almost did it. Let's try again. Closer to my eyes. There you go. Okay. Now, which one did I say? Oh, I did this... Um, snippets i believe is a part of of a challenge and i believe that's the first time i'm using it okay so if this goes here then this goes here right okay kind of kind of here okay let's do it i can always undo it if it's not right then i'm gonna boom Boom. I'm gonna do two or three times I feel like I feel like that's what we need to do I hated sewing my whole life I still do hand sewing well I don't hate it anymore but I don't really enjoy this <laughs> I don't like to do it I love my sewing machine but this I'm not a big fan of okay so if this stays on here now what do we need to do? We need to come back out. Okay. We need to come back out. And then what? And then take it out, right? And then I would glue it down here. And this one part stays. Oh, wait, wait. This needs to go through this. Otherwise it's gonna be on top and we don't need it on top. I think so at least. I think I need it on the bottom of this. Okay, let's try again. It would go like this, and then it would go like this. Okay, works. I figured it out. Now all I need to do is either stitch it, but I think there is stitching on, on this already, so I'm just gonna glue it. Glue 
let's put enough glue on there because it's going to go into the fabric as well. Soak in there. And nobody needs that. And now wherever it lands is going to be it. Right? Right. So, there you go. Now what do I need? I need like a bead or something on here, but do I have a bead? Oh, let me see. Do I have one? Of course I do have a bead. Not just one. I have a lot of stuff, but I wanted to into this one. Way too many things I have. What is, whoa! Things are falling out. Well, this one was really full. Look, I have this heart. Should we do the heart? I feel like we could. And this one has bling and buttons. We could do a button or the heart. But this one has these too. Oh, I think that's cool too. You know, maybe I'm just going to do that. I feel, let me try. I think I'm not going to do a bead or something. I'm going to do this. Or I'll do a bead and then this. I do not know. But I'm going to close it. Oh, now the flower is here. Okay. I'm going to close it the way it's supposed to close. Yeah, this is just long enough. See, I was thinking maybe like this. Because we need an end to make it a little heavier, right? So maybe just one of these. So you could actually hold it, but also it could be a bead, right? So let's make a knot. I think that's how it works. We can make a knot so the bead doesn't go through. I don't know if the knot is thick enough. Whoa, this one has a big hole. Okay, let's see. Can I? I can't. Oh, well, it doesn't go through it if you don't push it through it. Doesn't matter, does it? I'm gonna do more than one. How about more than one? Or is one enough? What do you think? More than one or is one enough? I'm beating. Yeah, I always wanted to know how to do that. And truthfully, it was always too much information for my brain. I could never, I don't know how to do that. Okay, so if I have those three, and then I would do this one. What if, I think it would look good. What do you think? But I need to tie it, otherwise it's not gonna work. Okay, so let me tie this. Into a knot first. I'm going to do it as close to the beads as I can without, you know, stressing about it. And then I'm going to put this on here and tie another knot. Yeah, all of this work here is no good for my fingers. Well, maybe it's good for my fingers. They get a little bit of exercise, but I'm having a very hard time with that. That's what I was saying. I really am. Okay. So I think that would be good, but I will need another knot. And you know what? Can anybody see this? I can't do this. There you go. Much easier than what I was doing. Yeah, my knot was not good enough. It's fine. Go back where you came from. Okay. Is twice enough? If not, you know, then, then I don't know. Okay, I'm going to put a tiny dot of glue on there. Just because it dries clear and hopefully it makes my knot stronger. 
right there. Ta-da! Look, is that cool or what? I think it is cool. Okay, maybe a little long. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it is a little long. Maybe it should be shorter. Should it be shorter so it can hang here? But you know what? We can shorten it just like that. I love it. It's a little handle. A little handle. So you can go like this and you can open it up. And I do not know if I should glue this and have this like glued. Or if I should just put two pieces of paper or three pieces of paper. I think that's what I like more. I feel like that's what I want to do. Maybe what I want to do is close all of this up so it doesn't go all over the place here. First, first of all, and that, oh my God, that was so terrible. Come on. I hate this when my, when stuff hurts in a way that I cannot move properly. That's, I don't like. Nobody likes it, right? Okay, I'm looking into the other thing first stuff here. I still have this. This wouldn't be enough. No way. What else do I have that is more like? No, this is all very decorated. Okay, let's look. Show who the cool papers. Maybe I'll find something in the cool papers. I need something that is cool. But I could still write on like this, for example. This is perfect size too. Maybe I should use this. Let me see. I just want like a piece. <gasps> what am I doing? I have coffee dye paper. Strips. Strips that I can use up. Finally, I just don't know. I think that's what I'm gonna do because everything here is now more or less straight and not wrapped. Whoa, <laughs> and not wrapped. <laughs> that was the universe. The universe like, not wrapped. Did you just say not wrapped? Wait, <laughs> wait, <laughs> we're not done. <laughs> I can still glue it because all I want is, you know, to be able to write on it. So that's why I'm not tripping, don't care. It just needs to be glued down here. Yeah, but this is the way paper goes sometimes. This is how it works. Okay, why didn't I put any glue on the edges here? Who knows? I think I did. Did it dry on me that quick? There's no glue on the edge. Same here. Edge, where are you at? Let's pick up the edge a little bit. Put some glue underneath. Same here. Okay, we're good. We're golden. Look at this. Now I can write here if I want to. And I can open it up. And I'm going to do another one. That's too wide. I wish I had another one. Oh, look at that. That's not that one. Oh, I have the, I think this is onion dyed. I have a piece that is on, and it is perfect. It's perfect. Just a little bit. I think it's onion. I don't know anymore. Uh, who can tell, right? Who can tell? Not me. I cannot. Tell. Well, this video is a little longer. It looks like. And what I'm going to do is I'm also going to decorate it a little. Especially because I don't like the iPod here. So we're going to decorate, basically, with a piece of leftover paper that's on the desk. Bloop, right here. Over the iPod. Bloop. Make it so pretty. Look at this. And now here, I don't know, this is too wide. Do I have another one? I do have... Oh, oh no, that's not wide enough. This is dark. 
And this one that cools, re cools really good, <laughs> looks really good. Or I will just go with the with this one. This one's not bad too. So let's see, where would I cut it? Right here and right here. I can cut it with my hand because it has lines. So I can be straight, hopefully. Or not. Who knows? Let's see. Does it fit? Yep, it fits perfectly right on here. So let's just put it on there. And once again, well, I would say it looks kind of similar to what was on my screenshot, but then again, not too similar. And all I wanted to do was to use up this metal thing from the can. Seriously, makes me so, so happy now. <laughs> so this time, I do not know where this came from. This came from, um, I know where this came from. It looks like Pinterest, I'm not saying. This looks like it was on Pinterest, but I, as you can see, this is my full screenshot and it doesn't say anything who did it and whatever, but I want to say thank you anyways to whoever posted this because yeah, you made me craft, you gave me this almost an hour of enjoying myself while well, I was renting a little bit. <laughs> But other than that, I'm enjoying myself for almost an hour now and I'm loving it and I'm having fun and I'm looking for something that, or maybe I should put it on here, something, because there's like this little thing now. Let's see. What do we have in our tiny pieces? Tiny pieces. I do have this. Oh, that's pretty. Let me just, I thought I had like this, um different oh yeah there are some other ones i think i'm gonna go with this because the other ones look like that this this piece is very pretty too though i like this piece too but i wanted to use something like that i will cover up wherever it was wrapped plus it kind of decorates a little bit okay so now it's a full writable thing here, right? You can write and send it off to somebody. And then you do this and you wrap it around. And it's beautiful, <laughs> in my opinion. I love it. I love it. Now who's going to clean my desk? <laughs> I do not know. <gasps> Ooh, what happened? Oh, there it is. I knew my needle was supposed to be somewhere here so okay if you did I tell you that if you have like a business and you sell these things and you're watching me then you know send me send me where to buy these so I can look at them if I like them okay guys loved it enjoyed it so much I hope you did too sorry about the little rant I love how I could use this snippet I think it's the first time I used one here this part looks good. I also love that I could use up, you know, different um, Happy Mail that was sent to me. At least a couple pieces of that. Also love that I used up my papers and, oh, love everything. Okay, let's say it this way. I love everything I used. And if you enjoyed this too, give me a thumbs up, share, sub, 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 subscribe. Sorry, I get my, my little weird time sometimes and um yeah i hope you enjoy your day i hope you're crafting and having fun don't stress too much i won't stress anymore today hopefully and i see you soon bye bye for now